Hi guys. How you guys doing? So, today what we're going to do is we are going to incorporate um yoga, but it's just going to be the fundamentals like the breathing and maybe a few poses um here and there into our favorite workout. Uh, we're happen to we're going to happen to use um Brazilian butt lift, but you're welcome to use any type of exercise that works for you, even Zumba, okay? So as you're tuning in, um, I'm not going to be able to see you because I did not get that phone yet, but I'm working on getting that better phone or getting that tablet so that I can be able to interact and you guys can ask me questions while I'm doing this. But for now, if you save your questions to the end, I will definitely come back and answer any questions you have. So we're going to get started, guys. You guys are the best. Thank you so much for your patience. So we're going to use Brazilian butt lift, right? Um, this is the Brazilian butt lift that we're using today is more of a cardio workout. And um, in this particular case, it's a really great video to do exercise to. But I noticed for myself that there weren't a lot of breathing cues. And obviously I'm a yoga instructor. So I'm very mindful about the body and breathing. Um, first of all, not only does the mind and the body have to work together in sync, but the breathing helps to unite them two together. So when we're doing certain um, like movement, right, the breath not only helps the body to be more the rhythms and to make the workout a little bit easier, more flowing, but it also helps to be able to tone and target muscle groups and get the most out of every single movement because you know you're not just working out to work out right you're working out to put your best effort forward so um we're going to use brazilian butt lift now i'm just going to kind of give you a, for instance of what some of those um exercises are that they're doing you'll see me do them and it may seem a little funny so don't laugh at me guys but it really is going to benefit you to be able to just keep in mind the fundamentals okay so we're going to start by just inhaling, grounding ourselves, and I'm just going to throw myself into the Brazilian butt lift. So right now we're um, doing the samba, the Baja samba. So inhale and exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Right? The other thing is our bodies, our alignment. You know, we're like this, doing the moment. You know how that is, right? Well, that's not helping us. So using our breath and our body, we want to make sure that we have good alignment, okay? And it's not a matter of doing it 100% correctly with the, um, the guy on your DVD, right? Especially if you're watching it from home or even with your t-shirt, right? It's a matter of staying safe, working within your own body movement, and also, like I said, maybe incorporating more breath into your workout. I would say that that's the most important thing. So now we're doing our little shuffle, right? Inhale, exhale. You can kind of hear him in the background. He's not providing any like breathing cues, right? You kind of have to figure it out for yourself. So squeezing the core. Everything is coming from the core. I'm being mindful of that, okay? So as you're doing your workout, regardless if it's Zumba or maybe even Insanity, you know, it's a lot of different workouts that you could do, right? You want to be mindful of your structure. And that's the one thing that we have in yoga, our alignment, our back body, vertebrae stacked on top of vertebrae, right? And then our breathing to incorporate to our movement. So now we're doing some hip rolls. Again, this is Brazilian butt lift. I do it a couple of times a week. Inhale, exhale. All right? Now I could be putting in, if I was doing this like without you, I'd probably be like, Whoa. right? But I have to be more mindful that I want you to be able to kind of get the idea of what I'm doing. So, 
Here's some hip rolls. And you go down. Knee stacked on top of ankle, right? Be mindful of my knees, be mindful of my body, my movement, my breath. Okay? Inhale, exhale. Come back into our cardio. Inhale, exhale. So we're going to do a two step. It's called hit the drums. Pacing myself. One, two, one, two. So like I'm finding the count inside my mind. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Right? Straight back body, right? Nice straight back. Touch step. Squeezing the core as I come forward. Really taking my toe, tapping it out. Squeeze. Always squeezing from the core up. So, I think you guys get the idea. The three types of things that we want to take from yoga and put into our workout, regardless of what workout that is, is number one, yoga fundamental, is our breathing and our movement. Mashing that breathing with our movement, right? Number two is finding that rhythm so that we can target muscles. So we're using our core. We're able to like go ahead and use our core or whatever part of that muscle group is to be able to get the most out of that workout. And then also it's our effort and our alignment. So just to be um, on a side note, effort and alignment. Um, why are they related? Well, because when you put your most effort forward, it's kind of when you're sitting up nice and straight. And if you think about that, everything that you're doing, you want to make it be the best because you are the best you, right? You're not going to give anybody half of you. You can't give yourself half of you during your workout. So your alignment is the other fundamental. So we have breathing with movement, you know, the rhythm, and targeting those core muscles, as well as um, alignment. Alignment, breathing with movement, and um, targeting core muscles. There you go. All right, guys. So I'm going to ask answer any questions that you might have. If you have anything, let me know. I'm here. Here's the this is the Brazilian butt lift. So you can see it. So there's hitting the drums. Let's see if I can get you closer. So this is just like doing it from home. Um not really big on always going to the gyms. They can get to be pretty expensive. And uh, I got a lot of hopes and dreams. I'd rather invest that money into, like, my business and, and so forth, right? So that's a lot of what, you know, a lot of what we did, right? Um, so just being mindful and as he's doing this, um, using that rhythm, using that breath, with a movement to create that rhythm. See how he's moving? Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. The alignment, all the ladies' bodies are pretty straight. You want to be mindful of that back body, those um, vertebrae that's inside of your back. Vertebrae stacked on top of vertebrae. Again, putting that best effort forward. And um, core muscles. Like As they're moving, everything is coming straight from the core. Okay? I mean, you may not be able to know that off the bat, but you got to squeeze that abdomen and also those feet and those thighs and lifting up from the glutes. That's how you're going to end up getting the Brazilian butt that you're looking for, right? Because it's not enough. It's not enough to just do the extras and go with the motions. That's the same thing like in life. You can't just go through the motions in life. You actually have to live and be a part of it, right? So to get the most out of something like this, especially from home, and to be safe, you want to try to start to think about incorporating some of those features and techniques that we talked about. Okay?
You have any questions? Okay. So, you can always check me out. I'm going to place this video on YouTube. Um, you can come back to it a couple of times. You know my, you know, my videos, I'm just starting out. But definitely, you can get some benefit from them. Um, and they're only going to keep progressing. So, on YouTube, it's Creative Minds Yoga. You can also check out my website, creativemindsyoga.com. And that's M-I-N-D-Z. D is in diamond, Z is in zebra. And um, also on Facebook. And as an instructor, I'm Rochelle Leanne. So you can find me online as Rochelle Leanne. And anywhere you connect with me, I'll be happy to connect with you. Okay? So thank you for joining me today. And hope you have a great workout, whatever workout that is.